overall, just thinking big picture, um, what what does FDA want? So, you know, in, in preparing for the speech, there's there's really a lot of things that uh, FDA wants. So I tried to just uh, narrow it down to, to a few. Um, so first of all, I think um, having a quality mindset and manufacturing facilities. This is extremely important to, to FDA. Um, in particular, there's an emphasis right now on quality culture. Uh, you see the quality culture uh, manifest in the new uh, inspection protocol project. Um, that clearly is a, um, is a part of, of NIP. Um, so FDA investigators are, are asking a lot of questions about quality culture. Um, they're asking uh, some of the things about um, knowledge management and continual improvement, um, uh, management reviews, uh, quality risk management. Um, so there's a, a, a big emphasis on that. So it's, it's going beyond the, uh, the, the functions of quality, um, you know, doing uh, investigations, uh, deviations, kappas, and more kind of big picture, broad, uh, broad aspects of, of quality. You know, what is the quality mindset uh, within the organization? Um, the reporting requirement, you know, the uh, reporting hierarchy for, for quality, um, the amount of resources. Um, you know, I've seen investigators ask a, a, a lot of questions um, on this area. Uh, you know, how, how, how do you, things that are previously, I guess, I, would have surprised me, but, you know, asking people in quality assurance, how do you enjoy your job? Do you have the resources that you need? You know, do you have management support? Uh, some of the things like that. So, um, you know, there's there's been um, a big emphasis on this, and quality metrics also has been, uh, you know, involved in uh, quality culture as well. So, uh, that's a, that's a big emphasis uh, for for FDA. And I think FDA wants uh, companies to understand their manufacturing process, uh, to to have a level of control, to monitor their their process, their equipment, their facilities. Uh, looking for process drift, looking for uh, variations in the manufacturing process, um, and to be aware of developing problems over time. I think there's a, a big emphasis on, um, you know, uh, investigators will ask companies uh, what type of monitoring they have over their, their process in terms of process control, you know, looking at maintenance orders for equipment, um, certainly looking for the state of uh, environmental control. So all of this is uh, geared towards, I think, um, FDA pushing companies um, to invest uh, in their facilities and continue to modernize their facilities. Um, that's really, I think, the emphasis is that FDA wants um, sites not to remain static, uh, but to continue to improve. So here you have a situation where there's, you know, a lot of uh, aging facilities out there and uh, FDA, I believe, wants to not only address the immediate problems with aging facilities, uh, but to continue to improve uh, the operations. Um, so uh, what, are, what are some of the, the hot button 